Okay, we're back inside theCUBE. Uh, this is siliconangle.tv and wikibon.org's coverage. Continuous coverage of uh, Hortonworks, uh, first event uh, that they're putting on, fourth Hadoop Summit here, but this one is big. I'm with Jeff Kelly, the, my co-host for the weekend, uh, the co-founder of Hortonworks, Arun Murthy. Welcome back to theCUBE. Thank you, I mean, this is my third time, and uh, <laughs> you know, it gets You're in the alumni club. <laughs> yeah. You're going to get the engraving on yeah. our little uh, third, uh, second season, so uh -huh. you, so this is our third season with theCUBE. Uh, Todd was just on talking about mm -hmm. um, uh, Hadoop Summit mm -hmm. four years ago when Yahoo yeah. ran everything. It was yeah. a small group yeah. talking about uh, mm -hmm. you know what they're working on, yeah. upgrades, code. Yeah. Now it's 2,500 people, it, and it gets you know bigger every year. I mean that's the exciting part. Um, um, you know, e you know every Hadoop conference you see, it, it gets bigger and better. So you know next year maybe 5,000 people. So I'd like to ask you a personal question, uh -huh. Arun. Um, been following your career since you left Yahoo a year now. Uh -huh. um, what's it like? Okay, I asked you the question when you left Yahoo. What was it like leaving Yahoo to come out and do an entrepreneurial adventure? One, it's risky. Um, you're at the mothership at Yahoo. You guys are doing some cutting edge work in, with Hadoop. T to jump ship and jump out and do your own thing with your, with your co-founders mm -hmm. is risky. But you got a good investor in Benchmark. Mm -hmm. They're aggressive, they're tier one. And index. And index, mm -hmm. these guys are good. Uh -huh. You're never going to run out of money. <laughs> How do you feel? I mean, what's, it, what's that year been like for you? So, I mean, frankly, um, if you look, I mean, if, you know, first of all, I don't know where this year went. Uh, I'd like it back. <laughs> <laughs> Things go really fast in the space. But, you know, as, as an engineer, right, I mean, it's, it's really, really cool to be able to, you know, not just look at, you know, a set of use cases, um, but also you see a whole new set of use cases coming into Hadoop, and that's the exciting part. I mean, you know, when, you, when we started doing Hadoop three, four, five years ago, we had you know, a fairly small charter, if you will, right, in terms of our use cases. Mm -hmm. So now it's not just, you know, it's only we have different kinds of people using it. You know, we have, you know, we're now talking about getting your Excel users to start using uh, Hadoop, mm -hmm. right? And, that's, and that kind of is really, um, you know, frankly, it just blows my mind to think that, you know, we're doing all this cool technology, all of this is open source, and yet we get so many people using it, so many people excited about it, and more importantly, it's being useful to so many people you know, whether it's healthcare or genetics or, you know, fraud or, you know, crime detection or whatever it is, it's really exciting to be in this space to actually make an impact in such a wide variety of use cases. Yeah. Well, you guys had, Eric was the CEO, kind of founding CEO, mainly because, I guess, no one else